what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so we have an update on what we can expect regarding the release of jeepers creepers 4 and how it'll be released into the public later this year in the fall sometime uh jeepers creepers reborn we know it's being directed by timo virenswola however you pronounce that last name still probably pronouncing it wrong and we know that we have a new writer writing this script we know that victor salva's identity of what he wanted to do for the fourth film is being scrapped and we're not going to get that uh even though those flashbacks with trish would have been nice to see what she's been up to over the last 23 years but timo viren while he's very tight-lipped he does talk about things that i guess he can talk about he can't release any spoilers of course and those of you who continue to reach out to him and send him messages um keep doing that but if they're watching this video, most likely he'll he'll get even more tight lipped uh, at the fact that if they're watching this video, because I'm, I'm sure someone in production with that film watches my videos. I'm sure they do just because of the fact that I've reached out to a lot of them. Um, I have and I have the YouTube channel link in my bio. So <laughs> Timo did talk to one of you guys. Uh, shout out to Jonathan, who reached out to Timo to ask him a couple questions asked him when of course could we expect a trailer for the film he responded i don't know yet but hopefully soonish they asked again is jeepers creepers reborn in the same universe with the first three films he stated no spoilers and then the last question is it going to be in theaters or on demand his answer both so jeepers creepers reborn jeepers creepers 4 it seems like the intent the plan is to have the film released simultaneously in theaters or on demand now that's not what they said in there that's not what he said in his exact words he just said is it going to be in theaters or on demand he's saying both that could mean it could go to theaters first and then get released on demand shortly afterward or yes like i said before it could have a simultaneous release in theaters and on demand now could this film being announced as a theatrical release put be a detriment to it i think so what i think they're going to do is they're not even going to announce this until probably short if their real intent is to have this in theaters i think what they'll do is they'll make this a last minute announcement i could see it happening i could see jeepers creepers reborn going to theaters being the last minute announcement they'll announce when it's coming out and say it's going to vod but they might hold off on that theatrical thing because then what that could do is open up a can of worms potentially for again for those that want to still be upset about the franchise and its history and the, the tarnished reputation it has because of the creator i get all of that but you know just announcing certain things that have to do with this franchise and a lot of other things that put people in a bad mood or just upset people and get them all emotional it's probably not going to be in their best interest to just flat out announce a theatrical release so early on because then that could lead to unwanted protesting on their end because screen media getting in bed with this franchise they're not looking to of course have it protested i don't think that's what their end game is here they don't they don't want to in spend their time investing in this only for it to backfire but i think they're also well aware of what they're getting into giving how like i said before the marketing so far has been kind of meh they're not really giving us much we don't know who the cast is we don't know any confirmation narrative wise from anyone involved in the film itself just what i'm digging up and what you guys are digging up and sending out to me which again we need to keep doing that because who knows when we'll get something official but the fact that they're saying or that Timo is saying that it's going to theaters makes me kind of excited because I do want to see this film in theaters. Hopefully it's a step up from what happened with Jeepers Creepers 3. Again, I am not expecting anything overly good. I am not expecting anything to be overly bad either. I'm expecting this to be at least something I can sit down and watch and not have too many criticisms about it other than the, the common things that I might have an issue with, such as character development, uh, being rushed in many ways maybe there's some odd moments in the film but nothing that would be overly illogical for me to complain about or something that's overly just mishandled with the production i don't want to see anything like that uh, i don't want this movie to be overly bad but i'm not expecting it to be overly good i'm just expecting it to be a movie that will make up for the failures of three because three in my opinion is yes a overly bad film for countless reasons i don't want this out of this film jeepers creepers 2 like i've stated before uh i love both of those films jeepers creepers one and two i tolerate three i watch it when i want to sometimes when i watch this franchise i don't even watch three but with the jeepers creepers 2 film 
that movie got a well none of none of these movies are, are rated fresh on Rotten Tomatoes if I'm not mistaken um, I, I think the first one was but then that got dropped but the second film was a step in was a step down for of course what we got in Jeepers Creepers 2 but it wasn't an overly bad film there was just some things narrative wise where it's like okay well why is this movie so confined to this tight space like this we have all these kids none of them are getting really enough time to be fleshed out whereas with the original we had this simple concept with two kids two young adults in college going home for spring break got to spend time with them grow and develop a relationship and a connection to them want to see them get out of this situation alive whereas with jeepers creepers 2 you had so many more things that were added in that it kind of took away from what what was working in that original film it's just the more you try to the bigger you try to go usually with a movie such as what that first film was and you're trying to now do something bigger than that you're gonna lose out on what made the original so good and that's 10 that's typically what happens usually when people do sequels that's just what happens with films uh usually sometimes you have films where they have sequels that outdo the original but I'm excited for it to go to theaters. Can't wait to see what happens with that. Can't wait to see if this theatrical release is a success. That's the biggest thing I'm curious about, if it's an actual success. Because if it's an actual success, then The Creeper really is back. And again, I'm just not expecting this movie to be something that's going to blow blow the first movie out of the water or even the second movie. I'm, I'm hoping that when I sit down at night, I can say I have a decent trilogy on my hands. I have a phenomenal first installment and even that might be a little bit over praising that film i have a decent second entry and i have a now watchable fourth entry and i'll skip over the third film until the day i die that's a, obviously a joke i'll watch jeepers creepers 3 when i feel like it but most likely after this fourth movie is out if it's decent enough i'm not gonna watch jeepers creepers 3 for quite some time but let me know what you guys think about jeepers creepers 4 apparently being released in theaters are you looking forward to that will you see it in theaters do you think this will turn out bad for screen media and those involved with the film if you haven't already make sure you subscribe turn on post notification and this video in the description i have links to my social media accounts on my facebook twitter and instagram you can message me there, of course, if there's any movies, news, or reviews you'd like me to cover in the future. But in my guys, I will see you in the next video.